Welcome to another tutorial. You can create very cool game assets like bottles or something like that with easy, from easy shapes with using the spin tool and I show you today how it works. First we delete the cube and then I have a shape as a vector file. Let's go here to file and import and import SVG file. Just select the file and import. And here it is. Select and rotate. And go to object. Set origin and origin to geometry and then shift S selection to cursor. You can activate the snapping. Just move it a little bit along the x-axis. And then when we go to edit mode, then you see that it looks a little bit strange. So at first we convert it into a mesh, go back to object mode and to object and convert to mesh. Back to edit mode, now it looks much better. Then let's go to the spin tool. And it shows up a few new options, like this plus signs here. And here you can spin around, like how much you want, something like that, the half bottle. But you can do it much easier if you want to make the full bottle. Just click with the left mouse and now we got a bottle. And just go back. And here we can also choose the steps. Change it into 24 or 48. And let's try it again. And now we get a clean bottle. You can also use materials or textures on it. I will show you in another tutorial much later. For today you know how to use the spin tool. If you found this tutorial was helpful then give it a like, subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye!